Good morning everyone, except for Donald Trump, long time no vlog. Today I'm going to try and vlog for you. Um, multiple times I've tried to vlog for you guys and I just kind of don't have inspiration for whatever reason. What am I doing today? I am going to a tax shop sale at one of our tax shops this morning and I'm so excited for it. And then after that, I am working at another barn right now, Monday to Friday, so I will be going there and working there for a bit, and then I will be going to my barn, and I will be riding um, Midas, and yeah, so I'll try and film bits of my day. Follow along, keep watching, and I will see you guys in a bit. Hi! Hello! I forgot to tell you guys I was meeting Madeline at the tax store for the tax sale. Uh, we bought a lot and spent a lot between the two of us. Probably over $600. But then again, it's horse stuff, so everything's expensive. So. Yeah. I bought new paddock boots. They're like super basic. Um, just area zip-ups. Yeah. Uh, lace-ups. Oh, lace-ups. Sorry. Yes, I tried on zip, but I like laces better. And just because mine are falling apart and I like to school in um, paddock boots and half chaps and save my tall boots. I got a leather crown piece. This is to replace one on my halter that Midas broke yesterday. Um, this one's like actually thick and stronger looking than the one that was on the halter. So that's good. This was like 20 bucks, I think. My next thing is I bought this Ogilvy pad. And it's so pretty. It's, um, it's, can you see? It's, this is lavender. It's yeah. gray, and then... Lavender? Oh, this is lavender, and then this is gray. Lighter gray. Yeah. And it's not, it's the full pad, not the baby pad. Okay, mm -hmm. next thing I got, another leather product, was this brow band. It's by... HDR is only $34 and everything in the store was on sale for like different Oh prices. yeah, that's why we went. Yeah. Because this <laughs> store from um, our local tax shop, it's very rarely will they have sales. They yeah. have like two a year. Yeah, so, so they had a big sale and um, I decided to get this because I kind of wanted like a pretty brow band. Yeah, it's like gold and it has little white diamonds. So Maddie, which is the horse I ride, I don't know if I said that in another video, but she has just like her regular one that says our paddock is absolutely trash. So I want to get a new one. Um, so this one was on sale and it's the Baker print and it's got the breakaway. Um, so yeah, that's just her new kind of paddock halter. And I have the exact same halter for Midas and that's the one he broke yesterday yeah. with the crown piece. But so. I think it's really cute on Midas because I so feel cute. like that Baker print kind of goes with any color. Yeah, I love that halter. Uh, next I got some bell boots. These are BR bell boots. Um, they're just like really basic but they are nice and plain and I like them and they'll go with anything. And I just wanted like a nicer, higher quality bell boot. I only have one pair, they're Kingsland, but they're kind of looking gross right now, so decided to treat myself to these. Okay, so this hat I definitely didn't need, um, but I really like my other Ogilvy hat, and I wanted another one to kind of just work in. So I got, and purple's my favorite color. So I got the gray one that has ombre, that's what I... Yeah. So it goes from... Yeah, really light to darker purple. That's really it. cute. I yeah. like it. It matches her saddle. <laughs> we got so many good things, <laughs> like so many nice things. Next thing I got was um, BR boots. They're just black, uh, like open front boots for jumping. Um, these were kind of the like more expensive model. Like there was another style, but they didn't have it in black and I really just wanted a pair of black boots. So I got these and then to match, I got the backs. So I'm really excited to use these. They're really nice. And lastly, what I got was these Rokel Sport. Um, so they're a different look and they're navy and white and a bit of black. But um, I needed something a bit more breathable because my hands, I feel like, are suffocated in the summer. Um, and people say that these are breathable and they're not like super ugly because I know Rokel has those. The... I the other ones it's like a the, mesh on this yeah. side and it's kind of funny looking i just i really don't like the look of those so 
yeah, got these. I've heard good things, so I'm excited. That's my last thing. The first thing that I got was this Ogilvy baby pad. Um, if it wasn't a full size pad, I probably would have gotten that, but whatever, it's not a big deal. It's a uh, hunter green with white and navy trim. And I've wanted a hunter green pad for a while now because I think it'll look really nice on Midas. It's the last thing I got for this giant haul. We got a lot of really nice things. Oh, person in the back. But also, I feel like they're not all useless. No. I mean, I, I didn't need any it. Uses, yeah. But like, we didn't. <laughs> I didn't need, need any of this. I needed new paddock boots. You did. You needed that. And I wanted it. I've been wanting a new halter for Maddie for a really long time. Yeah. We kind of went all out. But I mean, there's never really, like, very rarely do they have sales at this tax mm -hmm. store. It's not like Greenhawk where they have, like, sales all throughout the year. Yeah. And this is like all like really nice quality stuff and everything was on sale so we saved. I have no idea. I guess saved over a hundred dollars. Yeah. So I guess that's it for our little tack haul. And uh, yeah, um I don't know what I'm doing next yeah. today, but I will film more. Cool. Okay. I'll catch you in a bit. Bye. Hello. We're back. We're having a snack. We're sitting outside a coffee shop. We got what I get? An iced mocha. It's delicious. And I got an iced chai. And we're sitting right by traffic, so I don't know if you'll be able to hear us right now. Yeah, sorry. We went outside to vlog instead of saying inside. Okay. Um, since I last vlogged, which was like five years ago, I guess, yeah, looks ha has happened. I can't tell. Um, oh my god. What is this? Okay, so the sound is the crosswalks. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. And it drives me nuts. That's so like I this this is the only intersection that I know that have that sound. I did not know that it even was crazy. That. Anyways, uh, early May, no, just kidding. Early June, I did a show with Midas, um, and I posted a video of our fall from that. Yeah, so that happened. Long story short, the show was going really well. Um, our last jump of the last course we did, uh, we just got a funny distance and I fell off. And I ended up in the hospital and had to get stitches on my face. Blah, 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 blah. Um, so yeah, I'm fine. He's fine. And now I'm just trying to kind of like work my confidence back up. But I feel like that's basically it, like riding wise. So me, on to me. I, we've been, Maddie and I have been going through a bit of a rough patch recently. Um, it's, it's lasted about three weeks. She's back in the game now, but the problem is it's... Oh, we were supposed to do a show next week, but since I've been pretty much off and not really jumping here for three weeks, I am I don't feel like I'm ready to do a four or five day show with having her not performing well for that long. Um, so we finally, we had a good lesson today, but I, I have an, absolutely no idea what happened to her. I've never really seen this happen either. She, um, I just wrote her one day and she seemed to have completely forgotten how to carry herself. The only way she was carrying herself at Canter was either running or hopping. She couldn't keep her rhythm anymore. She was jumping, going back to her old jumping habits, jumping over her shoulders, ignoring all my aids. Anyways, point is we've been having a tough three weeks. Um, but we had our first good lesson back today, so I'm happy. I, re I really hope you can hear us. Um, yeah, so I'm hoping we're back. Uh, we have a clinic on, um, oh, we're both doing yeah, a clinic. Yeah, we're both doing We have a clinic on Tuesday, so it's, uh, what day? It's a Friday today. Yeah. But yeah, it's my situation. Other than that, like, nothing's changed, because Maddie was going super well. Um, yeah, I don't remember the last time I talked to like, I don't even think Madeline's really talked about her much. Mm -hmm. I showed her once in, like, a vlog a while ago. But I think it was back when we were riding inside, in the winter, yeah. like, when she first came. When That's she, how long it's been. You know, Maddie's progressed so much. Like, she already knows how to do everything. She's just really unfit. Yeah. Anyways, so, yeah, I'm happier today. Yeah, she's happier today. <laughs> Had a couple of mental breakdowns, but... We're back. This sport can be so discouraging mm -hmm. at times and like such a mental game. It's like, it amazes me sometimes, yeah. honestly. Well, other than like horse stuff, 
um, exciting news. Um, my family is going to be getting a kitten. Um, yes, that's what's nice now. And a dog. Yeah, and a puppy. Parents are in Europe right now, but when they get back in a few weeks, we're going to be looking for a kitten to adopt. And then sometime in the fall, the puppy will be born. I'm so excited. That's like, yeah, I feel like that's all. Um, oops, somebody's joining us. Oh, yeah. Right in the Okay, Perfect. well, okay. timing. Yeah, we'll end it here. So this is what I'm going to wear today when I ride. Um, an area polo, red and navy. Um, my Asmar belt, reversible belt in navy. Um, my mushroom colored tailored. And then I'm wearing Dreamers and Schemers socks. These are the food before dudes. And then my Ariat Paddock boots. Then I'll have my um, brown half chaps on too. So I'm just going to get my stuff out. And then I'll go get Mr. Midas. Tack him up and ride. Um, I probably won't have any clips of me riding sadly. But that's okay. So I already did my barn work. Um, I just got here from the barn I was at. Um, I would have filmed, but the owners were there, and I just felt like kind of awkward to start filming, so. Quick overview of my locker, which is full of stuff. Um, I need to organize it. And then all the doors for the locker. I have my bridles, my everyday HDR bridle, my royal show hunter bridle. Um, extra pair of reins, lead rope, a bit. Um, I have a chain, his leather show halter, his baker halter, which is broken, but I'm going to fix it in a second. Um, yeah, that part broke off yesterday. Because Midas was being a little shithead. Down here, I just keep my bathing stuff, which is in the very back. Um, behind those belt boots, the silver bucket is all leather cleaning supplies. I have my dressage whips on the side there. Green box that opens. Um, I have more boots. And then I just have some molasses um, and then some stuff for his feet. But I'm not using them right now because it's dry out and I don't need them. These are some saddle pads I have. There's actually a lot of them. They all need to be washed. Um, I have my pro-choice girth here, a rope halter, two other girths here. Um, this black bag is my grooming tote. Um, I have my helmet visor here. Um, and that box is just odds and ends. I keep my gloves in there, helmet is on top. Then here I have some treats back there. And then some uh, like Ecolicious products. There's some eye drops in there right now because I was having to flush his eye out. Um, there's sunscreen and argon oil for his tail. And then up there is one of my coolers. Um, a lunch line and in the green hawk bag, I believe his quarter sheet is in there. But I obviously don't need those right now. So if you guys want like a in-depth tour, I can totally do that sometime. Um, just let me know in the comments below. Hello, Santana. Hello, Omar. Hello, Miss Cherry. Hello, Shiloh and Chloe. There's Jem. Old lady. There's Cass. <gasps> Who that? Who that? Mr. Midas. Mr. Midas. Hi, bud. I got him a new fly mask. Um, it is warm blood size, but I feel like it's a little, little big for him. Um, actually, no, his part is the end of it's kind of actually bent up right now. But yeah, I'm gonna grab him and I'm gonna tack him up. And hopefully he'll be 
a good boy today. He was a good boy yesterday, but like, like he just seemed like he was in such a good mood. And if you know my horse, he's always in a grumpy kind of mood, like on the ground. And that's just kind of who he is. But yesterday he was like, he was a good boy and he was cuddly. So we'll see how he's feeling today. So I finished riding. Um, I didn't get any clips of me riding. Sorry about that, you guys. Um, so now I'm just grooming Mr. Midas. Um, I was just brushing his tail just now. And I'm going to spray some argon oil into it. Apparently that's really good for their tails. It makes them nice and shiny and smooth and silky. And then I'm going to put some fly spray on him. I just have the Bronco fly spray. That is what I use. Um, and then when I'm done that, I'm going to throw his cool coat on and I will take him back to his paddock so he can have his dinner. Our ride was good. It was really hot out. So, I mean, I feel like that kind of takes the energy out of you, but um, yeah, it was a good hack. So here's Midas. Um, I put on the new leather crown piece I bought today. All right, you guys, I am done at the barn. Um, put Midas away in his paddock so he can have dinner. And just cleaned up and stuff. I think this is probably the end of the vlog. Um, I'm gonna head home now and have dinner because it's after five o'clock and I'm hungry. Wow, I just look so lovely right now. So I lied and I um, said I was done the vlog, but I'm not done the vlog. Um, I just got home and realized I have a package waiting for me in the mail, which ended up coming a lot faster than I thought it would. So I have a package, so I thought I would unbox it for you guys. So I just got um, three things from Asmar. One of them is this burgundy uh, slouchy toque. I have this in white. So here's a better um, shot of the toque. So I'm excited to wear this. So I also got this sweater and um, it's just a dark gray color um, and it's a little bit longer at the bottom and then it says Asmar Equestrian on the side. Um, it's super soft inside. Um, I have to try it on still, but uh, I really like it from first impressions. Um, this was also on sale, so that's why I bought it. So that's what I got from Asmar. Not sure if you guys want to see, but I'm going to film what I got today at the tax store, but like a close-up film of it. Um, so keep watching if you want to see that, um, just so you guys can get a better look at what I got. Oh my god, the bags under my eyes. Some of that is dirt, but they're like really awful right now, and I'm so sorry that I look like crap. Yeah.